Hurricane Katrina was a very powerful hurricane that hit the United States of America from August 23rd to August 30th, 2005. This hurricane reached the maximum level of power, a level 5 hurricane. Most of the damage was in New Orleans, but there are still some places where damage remains even today. In New Orleans, the Lower Ninth Ward is still in ruins. Vines climb up walls. It is no longer the big urban location it was before. It's a jungle now. Houses are left half destroyed. The Lower Ninth Ward needs help rebuilding. They need people to donate money. There are still signs all over the Lower Ninth Ward begging for money that they require. But this state of ruin is not all bad. People who were homeless now live in these tattered houses, and even a house in ruins is better than nothing. When any hurricane comes, people always need to prepare. Hurricane Sandy may not have been as large and powerful as Hurricane Katrina, but America used what we had learned from Hurricane Katrina to help prepare for Sandy. Some Katrina survivors made a list of different ways to prepare for things such as texting instead of calling to save battery on phones and to read to stay entertained. At a certain point during Hurricane Katrina, people had to evacuate their homes. In New Orleans, many people resorted to the Superdome. The only thing states left out of their plans was a plan for to move people with disabilities. They thought that it would take too much time and effort to move people. Although this is disappointing, it shows just how desperate people were to escape. Hurricane Katrina drained the American economy of $125 billion. Our country will probably always have a dent from the catastrophic event that was Hurricane Katrina.